36 past two. We are in the car with my lovely niece and nephew and my sister and newborn Portia. Hello guys. Hello. Hello Anya. Hi, did you say newborn? Newborn Portia, oh not really newborn, she's, she's, a, tub, she's a baby. We're going down to mum's place in Culbarra Beach for Easter. But before we get there, I've got a few updates to my Selling the Vagabond application. First of all, I want to tell you about a response on my channel from uh, Andreas Harb. It's pretty scathing, I'm going to read it to you. It says, you can't, I can't balance this properly so I'll just read it out. It says, what a crybaby you are. If you use your mind, you understand there must be a concept to handle all this and this does not necessarily mean to watch every application the way you think they have to. Almost it's not even public to measure reactions on it. I don't think this guy's got English as a first language, but that's okay. Uh, nobody watched your video. You are the one and the only one who did not make it public. Ha 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 ha. What a loser you are. That's me. Nobody told me that I had to public make it public. And you call them dicks because you get a standard negative reply. Sorry, kids. Um, you're not even worthy of this measured by your behavior. So he's really hammering me here. All of this shows you are definitely the wrong person, so they did right, no. However they found this out, however this was decided, it was very right not choosing you. Now he's referring to my video saying that Selling the Vagabond didn't even watch my application video. Since this has been made public, I also posted on Selling the Vagabond's Facebook page, and I'll show you what I wrote. A quick message to them, I said, hey guys, Look, this is terrible, I can't do it while I'm bouncing like this in the car. I said, hey guys, I just received your email saying I was unsuccessful in my application. I'm just wondering if you even watched my application video. Now, the lovely crew at Selling the Vagabond replied and they said, thank you for applying, smiley face. We watched all the videos of future applicants. There are some awesome and talented people out there, including yourself, in brackets. It was a very hard decision to choose, and then a little picture of a watermelon, which I later found out it's a sailing boat. So, what this tells me is, I'm sorry to do this again, but you guys are flat out lying. You said you watched all the videos, and here's my YouTube page yet again, with my Selling the Vagabond application. It has had one view. That video is unlisted, only you guys have that link to watch it, and as of the post this morning on your Facebook page where you said you watched them all, it still has one view. So you didn't watch my video and because I'm calling you out on it, I'm getting negative, I'm getting negative responses all over my YouTube page. Um, all of this would have been avoided if you had have just said, we can't possibly watch all the videos, so unfortunately you didn't make it, we didn't even watch it, which would be the wrong thing to do. Am I getting this all wrong, kids? or would does this no, not sound... Let me check one of you, you've already watched it over. The statistics good. there is facts that shows that they haven't watched it, so if they're lying to you, there's, there's really no point of them to lie to you if they can just tell the truth and get over with the hate for you. <laughs> Telling it like it is. Look, I'm not... I mean, realistically, only one person's going to get this gig, and I just wanted but, you guys to watch my application and make a decision based on that. That's not that unusual, but yet I'm getting called all kinds of, <laughs> I'm a loser basically for bringing this up. Ah, no, no, oh, thanks kids. So yeah, Riley and Elena, if you want to hit me up on that and explain further, I'd definitely love to know what's going on. Like, otherwise, you know, you walk the plank. Yeah, <laughs> otherwise, you <laughs> walk the plank. 